All right, welcome to Smoking Reacts. I'm your boy, Journalist, and on this one, we are here to check out episode two of Castillo's Cuffin. This is going to be, uh, I think it's the brown skin shorty is on episode two, so see see what her chat's talking about. She was on that episode with Lippy as well, so we've seen her before. Uh, that said, though, thank you for joining me. If you could, please hit that like, subscribe, Patreon's in the description, and let's get into this. I got too many hoes. What is your favorite feature? Shout out to my you? nigga Brent. I love your hair. Big man team. I wouldn't even like it if you did. When, when, you're when we to get into the role play team, you get me. <laughs> I'll be on some Enrique Iglesias team and you can you get me. You just go in, bro. We do a switch? Big, no, we're not doing a switch. What kind of zesty team? We're definitely not doing a switch. But yo, whoever's a standout TV, cuz, whatever ratings you guys put your shit on, this ain't 1080, black. And I'm this YouTube man. It's not about to pay you, man, for no motherfucking fashion. You man. suck my dick. Big man ting, yeah. Big it's Castillo, ting, yeah. aka a baby it's mom's favorite, aka say something on all digital so platforms. Noise. Man. And this is Clout Chasers. My order's still the same. I'm not changing my order. Now, big man ting, yeah, bruv? We live in a world full of clout chasers. And right. last year, I got completely finessed, man. Oh, yeah, just like my nigga be doing. What is it? Global Cypher, out now on the Culture Clan channel, right now, just dropped today. The gal took all my peas, bruv, and she left me for nothing. Jeez, I'm sorry. Nah. Right. It's not looking good, bruv. So now I'm back, good, bruv. and I'm not messing about, bruv. Why can't a real G like me find real love, bruv? Now, big man ting, yeah, after dating all these beautiful women, I'm gonna pick one and I'm gonna slap some money in front of them and I'm gonna see if they're here for the money and clout or if they're here for real love, bruv. This is clout that. chasers. Let's find out. Let's find what out. Is favorite, what is your favorite feature on me? I love your hair. Big man ting. I wouldn't like it if you did. When, you're when we get into the role play ting, you get me. <laughs> I'll be on some Enrique Iglesias thing and you can you get me. You just go in, bro. We do a switch. Big, no, we're not doing a switch. What kind of zesty thing you're on about, bro? <laughs> AKA a baby mama. Man, for net. Ah. About. Yeah, this is clean. I. Hello, hello. My name is Jane. I. I'm a model and a beautician. Right now, my dating life is. It's a bit boring, like I've really been by myself. I've just been focusing on me. In terms of looks, like I, I like good looking guys. Definitely taller than me. How tall is Shorty? I don't know, for, as it is right now, I'm a bit open, but they have to be ambitious at the least. What's more important, love or money? Money comes first and the love can follow. Have I been with some? Good times. Good times only. This is a dark one. You're going to need a bank account to tie this one down. I've broke before. Um, I've entertained someone broke before. Okay, baby, Damn. You already know. Got a this bad bitch from the 902 But will I ever waste my energy in that? No. The answer is no. Have I been with someone in the public eye before? Yes, I have. Would I do it again? Yes, I will. I'm just expecting to get grilled, or yeah. I'm expecting to, yeah, so to just Cause this is me. a lot of, this is a high maintenance bird right here. Ain't nothing wrong with being a high maintenance bird, but how much of this maintenance is natural and how much of this maintenance is doctor given? Cause that does matter to me, but next man it might not matter to. So this is where I'm, just, I'm curious. And then do I ever get your natural side that is not like weaved up in all this makeup. Cause if I don't, obviously I'm not on the show. Shorty has no idea who I am, but she, next man is, is for sure not for me. But it's fine, we can work both ways. And I'm just open, like I said, I'm just here to see and see what Raise that profile, get in front of some folk. Hello. Big man ting, yo. Big man ting, yeah. Nice to meet you. No, nice to meet you too, Jane. Wow. The Boondas. 
Beach man things. Have a seat. Definitely have a seat. <laughs> Yo. Yeah, beach ball. It's all looking good, bruv. Okay. It is all looking good. That's the Everything is looking like <laughs> looking like your AI right now. <laughs> Big man thing. Just mastering the gallery. I wonder if he's gonna bring up Shorty was already so, on one of his where shows. Where you come from? Where you from? Uh, you know these see this is the part of the show that like, fuck man. We know who sh- we seen you two talk before. Y'all know each other. No. Ah, I see. You're out of breath right now. You need to catch it. I know you're sitting in front of me right now. I know, but some steps. It's all good. <laughs> the nerves is moving mad. Don't worry. It's all good. It's all good. Don't worry. See, the I orange The orange, everything is popping. Is it busting? Big the man orange and our brown is doing the thing. What's the tattoo you mean? Which ones? I see the tattoo right there on the chest. This one? It that says, one right there. God is always with me. Big man ting. He yeah. definitely is. I can see everything <laughs> is looking very godly. Clearly. Big man ting. I'm not going to lie. And what's on your hand? I got love. So you've got some knuckle tattoos as well. Big man ting. What does that say? That says hope and that says pray. Okay, it makes sense. I've got to notice something as well, yeah. You're moving very lavish right now. I like the watch. Oh, thank you. Big man. Who bought that for you, though? Who bought that? I I got it myself. You bought that yourself? Yeah. Tell the (laughs) truth. Honest to God. So in your mum's life? So in your mum's life, I got it Big man, till you close your eyes bare when you say so. Just in your mum's life. No, I saw your mum's life. 100%. I did. Big man. So what'd you do then? I'm a model and I'm a beautician. Mm. So, for the fillers and the Botox and things like that. Big man thing. You see yeah. a lot of girls say they do certain things. Mm-hmm. yeah. And you see them, you're like, there's no way you do that, baby. Because you look <laughs> mashup. But you look... I look I'm a product of my... Yeah, yeah. Done, though. Done, Good though. advertising. So, Thank you. what kind of guys are you into? I like the leader of the pack. Like, mm, you like the alpha man? I like the alpha man, yeah. Mm. That's right. You don't like the side man? No. Mm-mm. Big man thing. So is that off putting Of course. Me... I don't want the runner. I want the bouse. You want the main man? Yeah. So what about the man that's like, yo, man, man's the DJ for my guy. Well, <laughs> you, you're not feeling that. <laughs> or man does the security for my guy. Oh, no. No, no, no. Mm. No, that is not, that's not good for me. That's, that's not. But if my, what if my man got the bag, though, still? Not no, for you. That's not fair. No. Come on. How do you think Jane is getting on? Oh, well, I don't know. I feel like she went really quiet just before the yeah, date. She I, yeah, I think, yeah. She, might be nervous. Yeah, I think she was nervous. Yeah, because she she's gone really quiet. Tanedja was up there, and then she was kind of like, yeah. yeah. So I think maybe she's a bit nervous. I don't know why I feel like that date's gonna be. What really other bird? I'm gonna make an observation, and it's mm-hmm. a compliment. You see, the BBL is BBL in right now. Right. I'm telling you, everything yeah, is. That's right. Don't know. You see what I lo- this you know, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> You know how to maintain your ting. Mm-hmm. Some girls they're out here, they do it, and then they come back yeah, to yours. They're looking like strawberries, bro. It's a You got a what's it called too? It looked good with the clothes on. It's that out outside the clothes. Is is the ting still tinging? Because with the clothes on, bravissimo. It's just still going to be the same later. That's why we're not keeping it 100. Because it could be a whole madness up under that. I'm loving that still. I'm loving that still. So, you know what this show's about, right? Correct. Clout chasers, yeah? Mm-hmm. So, I'm trying to read out. The gal that's here for the money and the clout, or the gal that's here for real love. Which one are you after? Well, I like a bit of both. Mm. So, so you like some clout too? Oh wait, wait, hold on. <laughs> I you want listening. the money and clout, <laughs> or you here for love? No, there's love, like clout. I don't really need clout, but you know. So you got the clout? Is that what you're trying to say? <laughs> you you, you, you already that. You already that. <laughs> you already. I have enough. Oh, you have enough? I have enough. Big man thing. So why do you have enough? Why do, what do you do to get all of that? Because I just have some supporters and things like that. People mm. love and follow the journey. Are Especially we talking about like, OnlyFans thing right now? Is that what you're saying? Uh, no, I'm not talking about that. Okay. Yeah. Would you do that, though? Talk about it. that, though. You have only fans. Yeah. Big man ting. Big up your ting, though. Thank you. You got to <laughs> shout out your ting. Shout Come out. On. It's Jane Lavish one. So OnlyFans. We got to get into the serious Yee. stuff now. Okay, I'm listening. Bit or swallow? Hmm. Starting off heavy. Yeah. Respect. Welcome. See, yeah. I rate that. There's a lot of girl here uh-huh. trying to basically compete. Mm-hmm. You get me? To see who the winner is, who I'm going to pick for the wifey. What do you yeah. think about the other girls? Everyone is their own individual person. So they all come. Are you trying to say they're dead things? No, I'm not saying. Everyone is coming. All of them are different characters. Mm. Like. Any, any in particular that you're not really feeling like that? Anybody that's getting a bit, chatting a bit, chatting a bit of grease? 
I feel like you're saying, yeah, yeah she lying. No. Big man thing. She lying. So I like a woman that can handle herself. Okay. Yeah, I like a woman that, you know what I mean? Like they can, right. they get busy. Are you, can you handle yourself? What do you mean? Can you bat up a gal if it, right? If can you beat bitches up? If it need be. If it need be, because mm. I'm a very unproblematic person. Or at least just push shorty in a headlock. Get to fights, but well, was recently I had to do what I had to do. You had to recently go in a fight? <laughs> yeah. Where, 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 why'd you get in a fight? What happened? She just take your man. What's she doing? No, she wouldn't give me back my dog. She won't give you back your dog? Yeah. Well, I don't want to talk about it. Is there some illegal dog fighting thing you've got going on? <laughs> no. What's going on? No, my dog is like my child. So, but yeah. I don't want to talk about it right Big now. Big man, I feel, <laughs> I feel like there's a pending case still. So we don't, we don't need to talk about maybe the people that are after certain people. You get me? We just, we mm. got to keep that yeah. off the thing. You get me? Yeah. So, have you ever been flown out before? All the time. All the time. Okay. Well, Big man thing. Come on. Who's flying you out though? People that you're not know. selling pussy or anything. No, I'm not selling pussy. No. You tell the truth. You're, you're not selling, selling pussy on uh-uh, there. Uh-uh, no, I'm not selling pussy. I'm Big man thing. Look at that. Don't don't you be selling people no pussy. That, uh, live in other countries and stuff like what, that. What, what do you mean? Did, what, what, why are they flying out to just, other countries? No, it's because I you're know. You're scaffolding. What are you doing? No, I mean like. If it, <laughs> come what are you doing? I'm asking. What are you doing? That's crazy. I'm a whole vibe. Like people want me around. People want me to do what though? Like what are you doing? It don't even matter. I might even. I can't even have like a spare room in the whole place. No one disturbs. Like if you're just lodging. That's mad. I'm gonna fight. I'm just saying that. What are we doing in the yard, though? I'm saying, like, what are we doing at? Just having a good time. You turn on your party. You know what I mean? You mind your business. You get everyone hurt. You're just having a good And they're paying for this? Yeah, people are paying. How much do they pay for that, though? Come on. You can talk. Let me invest in the business, though. Like, what what we We can talk off camera. Come on. Is it some trafficking thing, like, No! You're not on what you're on, like that. No! So you know you've got the pending dog thing going on, (laughs) but, bruv. It's not about the trafficking thing. She banned her ass. I'm just saying. Her but up. like you wouldn't go, you wouldn't date anyone who hasn't got money, would you? No. <laughs> like, why would I disrespect myself? Is that disrespecting yourself? Yeah. What you think I'm gonna date someone who takes me to McDonald's, honey? I'm going to know you. That's all I'm saying. Wait, so what do you bring to the table then? Because you're obviously demanding from the man. What's that you would do? Yeah, would you like honey. be housewife, do the dishes? Yeah. See, we, can, yeah. can we change the terminology on what you bring to the table? Motherfucker, I got demands. I don't give a fuck about what's on the table or not. This is my requirement. Could it be delusional requirements? Sure. But I got requirements. It's the, the table has nothing to do with it. And be like, oh, what does a motherfucker bring to the table? The amount of men that I know that pay for significant others without them bringing anything that we would socially call or societally call a fucking like a thing that should be respected on the table. Like, it's just stupid. It's stupid. Like, what are your requirements? And then who's, how willing is the person you're dating to meet those? Because that's really all that matters. All that, oh, what do you bring to the table shit? Don't matter. It don't matter. Yeah, I would. But at the same time, there's going to be a maid in the house 24. Like, and there's going to be a chef. She's I'm about gonna, that life. <laughs> yeah, I am. So you like the lavish life? Is it not, is it not evident? Yeah, does not every girl no. need to have? No, it is not. Lavish life? I'm not going to lie, I love it. I do love Thank you, Layla. I yeah, like the lavish it. life, but I like to give it to myself. I don't want a man doing it for me. I, kind of want to I think I like the balance of both. Like, obviously, it's nice to be treated and have somebody who treats you really well and, like, can, I guess, you know, surprise and do nice things for you. But at the same time, I feel like, I don't know. Like, I feel like anyway. It's... Mm-hmm. How Them ladies the with the you? bag. You know what it is? It's not about how much you're making. It's mm. about... Can you? If anybody's there for the money, it's it's denim jacket. It's denim jacket. Everybody else there for a bag of. Maintain. Can you maintain? Can you support? Can can you match my? Can you match me? Mm. You know what I mean? Can you match the lifestyle I've been used to already? What if, let's say for example, yeah, no the fuck I can't, like and I'm shooting for the goddamn moon. And guess what, brothers? You can do that. They say what they say, but depending on how charming and good looking you are. Because you can have you can have no draws. You can have holes in your draws. I promise you, you can still win. Maintaining the team. Okay. Then one day, you walk in the room and you see the universal credit voucher on the side. Like, the you universal credit card. What are you saying then? <laughs> then you can't maintain. What are you saying then? I mean, the thing is, everyone goes through something like bad times, yeah. So it can be like a little hiccup. I have to know him enough to know what's going on. 
So you would stick by him while he's going for this hiccup? It depends how good the, how good the whole thing well, how is. How good the willy is, is that what you mean? That too, of course. Mm. Just the, the energy and the bounce and the energy and things like that. But if you like, the thing is, I, I don't get along with a lot of people, but if I really do fuck with you, then I don't just want to... Why don't you get on with a lot of people? I'm not for everyone. You fucking people's I, man? No, nah, okay. it's not that. It's, I don't want to, I'm not, I can't be bothered to share my energy. I can't be bothered to start getting to know everyone. Mm. I can't be bothered to like, I don't have like standards of what I want. Mm. So if you don't need meet them, It sounds like a very time? lonely life. Mm. Like, so I'd rather just share it if I know you're a good fan. But I'm also like a major people weird. person. I don't even know like who's really there for you, mm. for, for what, or they want to fuck, they want to, you don't know. So if I have something that's good, I'm not just going to like, walk away because mm. of a little hiccup. Yeah. So what's there. like the most expensive gift the guy's ever got on you? Probably just how me paid towards something. Paid towards something? Why yeah. are you paid towards? It doesn't matter. Like I was like, I, when I bought my car, I put like most of it down. So You paid for the, the whole whip? I just like finance like 10K, um, the last 10K of it. So You're moving very smart right now. You got him yeah. to big so man thing. I just, yeah. How long did that last though with the guy that did that? Um. Still, if I I can talk to him now, to be honest. So you're gonna shout him one I, time? I, I, no, it's like I I don't. I like don't yo, don't, yo, Mr. Akbeem, like send send me. Why did you give I'm me just saying, bro, he's, <laughs> he's, a, he's an international <laughs> man, bro. You get me? Like yo, Mr. Akbeem, bro, I need that twenty k. <laughs> Big man, thing. shout out to, to Mr. Akbeem, Mr. Akbeem. Come on. <laughs> Are you a freaky girl? <laughs> Major I questions. Think, I feel like you got that. that Major water questions. Like super squirty. You're super soak at XT5 right now. All of that. Oh. Would I be wrong if I said that? No. <laughs> so, you know your so, thing. You're confident about your thing. So let's say me and you was like together doing a thing or whatever. We've been seeing each other for a few months now. Right. Yeah. And I say, yo, babes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm looking at you. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Everything's perfect. All right. I want another you in the bedroom. I want two of you. Hmm. Yeah? Okay. That's a no. Cool with that that face right there, cuz. Two of you. Hmm. Yeah? Are you not embarrassed? Is it not embarrassing? That's all I hear in my head right now. Like, you think you're gonna get all this, and then I'm gonna let you just bring next gal in? Now, if that's already her type of time, calm. But this face tells me, nigga, you crazy. Okay. Would you be cool with that? It's come up before, and I I wouldn't mind. Like, mm. but like, I made it clear that it's gonna be a thing where it would be like someone random, no one in like in my circle. It has to be a random thing. Yeah, it would have to be like on maybe like on a holiday or something. I can't be a no, girl, you know. Nah, 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 nah. It has to be something that you know. This is just one night of fun because mm. everyone loves a bit of fun. Let's be honest. So in that so, situation, how yeah. freaky are you getting? Are you eating a naan bread? Uh, you're not part of the situation, so you can't ask me all these questions, okay? I'm just, I'm just, oh, I'm just, I'm <laughs> just trying deflection. to for purposes. You get okay, me? you know, I told you, I laid it out on the table that this is... Fair enough. Nick, did you get the details? If you get to be in the details. If not, my brother, you know, you know what type of time she on. What kind of party it is, but, mm. you know... We don't need to go into details. Ain't no party like yeah. a yeah, what party. What if your man was a billionaire, but he was cheating on you? You found out he's unfaithful. Just know I'm gonna have a side thing. The fuck? I'm living the life I want. Not only that, but he's cheating. I cheat too. The fuck? 21st century, honey. You think I'm not gonna cheat? What is it gonna hurt my feelings? Like, no, it's not. I mean, I'm gonna make sure that my lawyers. Yo, I'm saying. Like, shorty on the left, even though she's fit, she just looks dead inside. <laughs> shorty on the right, this is like, why did I even fucking come here? Like, I'm not like these people. <laughs> and then shorty on the right, ah, oh, it's just, just a toxic demeanor. Just toxic. This is not going to be a healthy relationship. You know, put together an agreement where I come out thriving regardless. And I'm going to have my own career anyway. Yo, man, it's going to make you sign a prenup if you watch this show. <laughs> Honey, I'm not getting married. That's all I'm saying. I'm getting married to myself and that's it. Period. Next question. No. So what happens to the old fashioned ways of meeting girls or, or girls in the DMs? What happens to all of that? Because I think all the girl in the DMs, they're crazy girl and mad girl. Right. So having... I think a lot of girl are just mad out here. And I'll be honest, I, I don't want to bring any girl to my yard like that. you got to be careful. It's true. One time a girl came to my yard mm -hmm. and she started burning incense and candles in the thing. What's wrong with that? She was a mad girl. <laughs> Big man ting. Are you a spiritual? Rude on that you nigga. believe in that stuff? I'm 
not a spiritual person. You're not a spiritual person? No. Why not? You're all about the money and that. No, you want me to say I'm all about no, the money. No, but I'm asking, so if you're not it's spiritual, just, though, so what you... No, what? I mean, I haven't tapped into, like, that kind of thing. I can go to church, no problem, but in terms mm. of the whole spiritual stuff, well, I don't, I'd rather what I don't know, I don't... Like, I don't want to overlook into things and all that stuff. I'd rather just not know about anything and just mm. be oblivious, be in my bubble and just do good. So, so in terms of spiritual... It's not bad, especially when it comes to this Western Christianity shit. Now. Get How deep on a spiritual level. Get, get spiritual on a spiritual level. You could burn some incense. Burn some incense. Start burning up the sage and thing. You get me? <laughs> All them stuff there. Well, like, heck, I can do that. Like, I'm a really good like masseuse as well. Mm, so, what if we was role playing in the bedroom? What would be happening though? Who would you be? Like, what, what's the scenario? Depends. I could be Doc. I could be Mr. Agbeam, and you could. <laughs> you get me? You could just role play that <laughs> scene. You get me? Because uh, there's a lot of scenarios that's so going. What, what's your perfect? Um, your perfect like role. You see, the thing is, yeah. I'm a very dominant person. Okay. Right? So you want to hold the whips and the, and the chains? No, no, no. That's a, not all of that zesty stuff, man. <laughs> yeah, you know? so but then? I'm saying in the sense yeah. that I'm a very dominant person mm. and I'm very rough. Mm. Yeah. So, yeah. like, I like grabbing. Yeah. The, but so, but at the same town. time, I sometimes want to yell mm. to kind of bad me up. Yeah. When I okay. get out to just throw me against the wall. Dominatrix. No, not dominatrix, because that's zesty and man's not on no gimp thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm saying like I wanna get let me know how bad up. you want. You get me. Do the scratches on the back. You see the nails you got oh, there? Perfect. Come on. I hurt myself like twelve times. You today. see what I'm saying? I want the scratches on my back, you get me? I wanna look like Django up in there, man. The scratches, you get me? Jesus Christ. How are you gonna suss out from uh That's how it look like Django is crazy? That someone's about love for money. You can tell by the vibes and how someone's okay. coming across to you. You get what I'm trying to say? I'm like, you know, you know when you look at a guy and you can tell within like 30 seconds if you're going to give up the money, money now. Nah. Yeah? They don't want me, that money now. Nah. I'll be like, okay. you look like a mad girl. You're crazy. Mm. You look like you're going to be a future problem. If right. I give you the good Facts. willy, you might go crazy. You might go crazy. You Yo. get me? And then mm. your craziness, is it a craziness that I'm going to find sexy? Or is it a restraining order thing? Right. <laughs> have you ever had a I have called the feds on a have girl you, before. Have you, do you got a restraining order against him? No, I called the feds on a girl before. Oh, wow, that's wild. Yo, big man thing. The, the facts. Big man thing. Yo, fellas, y'all need to start dialing 911 or 999 way sooner, blood. I don't care how I look, nigga. You want to look crazy to a man them or you want to have a police record? <laughs> Cuss. <laughs> start calling the police start using your legal rights i don't give a fuck how you feel nigga shit you, you, you gonna you gonna hear this shit echo back when your ass got a motherfucking case on your ass because you could have called the police but oh, i'm too tough for that shit the nigga you better call thing she was just showing up on a random thing just to the yard at random times no we're not so gonna I do that to make a, a call to the old bill man we're not I'm gonna sorry. do that i had to do a six nine i had to <laughs> let them know this gal is outside my yard that's right you get me i'm not yeah. trying to i didn't want i didn't want no problems mm. you get me i like a stress-free life i know you get me i don't like no drama you i need me? you I to be my peace but you, but you like a little bit of toxic right I know, but I you to toxic. show me love i need you to bring me peace on a scale of one to ten i need me some i'm not I'm like a, a three. A three? Yeah. Mm. Just, just the right amount. I want peace. You want peace? I want, you want peace. peace. I thought you said well, peace. I want, oh, that's, I'm joking. No, but. you're not joking, but it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> cool. I'm talking about every guy on this planet has cheated or will cheat in the future. Period. I want to know who broke your heart. Right. I don't know. Girl, don't know. Girl, no one's broke my heart. So how did, like, I don't think, I, I can't think, I can't believe you can think that every person in this world cheats. Like, I've been okay. with the cheater. Okay, well, the majority, the majority. What would you consider cheating? What's I'm not even saying the majority, guys. You have to hide from personal web. Someone messages you on Snapchat and you clear the conversation before, if they ask you to use your phone and you clear the conversation, you've cheated. You've I don't cheated. agree. Really? I feel like... Why are you asking me to use my phone? Why are you even caring who the fuck I talk to on Instagram? Why does that shit even matter? Like, 10 years you've been with a partner. He's never had sex with anyone else, but he might have flirted with someone else on a night yeah, out. Yeah. He might have entertained one DM he got. Like, is that cheating? What? He has in the relationship. I'm saying you've been with someone for 10 years. I'm not, like, I'm just yeah, saying. Yeah, 10 years. What is he doing with somebody in, out in the DMs, like? But is that cheating? Yeah, I think That's entertaining what I'm saying. stuff That's is kind of considering. I would consider, yeah. I wouldn't call it cheating. What are you saying? Oh, come on. I'll be back. 
Oh, excuse me about that. Got that dinner call. I had to go. Cheating, but I think, again, I'll consider that disrespectful. Yeah, if because if he's going to no, be, be that, then he's yeah. going to do other stuff. I think if you're in love with someone, je you just... If man's cheating, what other stuff is there, though? Like, if a man's cheating at will, what other stuff do we have left to do? If, if you could be involved in everything but our cheating, what else do we have to do? I don't understand. This is, I'm like, she's just talking. And you don't want to, so if they're not in love enough, then I, I don't want to so, be yeah. in them anyway. Well, for a long period of time, do you not feel like people fall in and out of love? I mean, I guess there's obviously, like, rough parts everyone hits, and I guess maybe that's where you may or may not entertain something, but I feel like, I wouldn't call it cheating, but yeah, it's definitely disrespectful, and I feel like I wouldn't like it. Mm. But again, would I leave somebody just because they match with someone on Snapchat or send a DM? Probably mm. wouldn't. It just depends where, it was, <laughs> where this was going and how much I trusted them at the time. And like, See, this is where... This is where personality becomes king. Because she's definitely sitting next to who I would consider visually to be one of the fitter birds. But her personality and the chat she has, I'm just like, to be fair, bird, maybe we should be paying a little bit more attention to you. Like what the story was? So, you. you've had a nice date. Right. How have you felt about the date? I think it's gone well. Like... Mm. A good energy, good vibes, mm -hmm. funny, <laughs> very funny. Thank you. So I'm gonna ask you this. So, right. I'm gonna ask you two things. Yeah. I'm listening. So, what's your best feature? I think it's my smile. Mm. Smile? Yeah, you do have a very pretty <laughs> smile. Colgate so, smile. what is your favorite feature on me? I love your hair. Big man thing. I want it like if you can make a nice. Wig. <laughs> when, you're when we get into the role play thing, you get me. I'll be on some Enrique Iglesias thing, and you can you get me. You just go in, baby. We do a switch. Big, no, we're not doing a switch. What kind of zesty thing you're on about, baby? <laughs> like, baby, you're getting guests of the Arcwave Pal, baby. The Arcwave Pal. Chill out, baby. None of that. Yeah, Sorry. Yeah. Doing the rough thing. <laughs> anyway, I've had right. a nice date with you. Same. And we'll see if I pick you for the next round. Okay, it's nice yeah. to see you. Big man thing, but it's nice to meet you. Mm -hmm. And then give you a hug. All right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Come mm -hmm. here, give you a hug. Yep. Mm. Jeez. <laughs> Jeez. Nice to see you. Take care. Healthy. Two C's for tick. She's tick. Man, you know the ones where you Dip just want to put your face in it, man? Oh, no. I'm just saying, man. If you get me. Mm. Hit him with the Cavos look. J-Girl, where you She's at? She's back. Ooh! <laughs> Okay, hey, ladies, how are you? Smiling, hey, so. Right. It went well. Tell us. It went really well, I'm not gonna lie. But, like, we just was bouncing off energy. Mm. But he wasn't, like, hard on me. Like, I wasn't. No, he wasn't. He was really calm. So, did you have any ick? No, there wasn't anything. Was there any? The conversation she was used to the breath. I wasn't, like. Fine. No, it wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> the conversation was okay. Selling like, it. It was okay. Girl. That it was quite, yeah. Why was, are you laughing though? Did you? This girl. Okay, girl. So, oh, do you think, would you go on another date with him? No. Did you come on yesterday? Yes. Yeah. It's a yes. Next time on Clout Chasers. Yeah. Came out in the lingerie today. Big man thing. Have you just for you? So, are you the baddest thing in the whole city? I'm the baddest thing in the world. Big man, the world? Don't know yet. The universe. In the UK right now. So what'd you do for yourself? Like, what would you do for a living? I use men. You use men? I said it was dark on it. I said it was dark. But yeah, that's it for this one. We'll check out episode three. You know we're going to watch the rest of these. I fuck with Costello. So whatever he's doing, I'm supporting the thing. Enjoy the reactions. And they are beautiful women. Some personality traits just make them look less attractive. But physically, come on now. You know what it is. Uh, that said, though, shout out to Stand Out TV, too, for supporting Costello. Because they've been really, like, they didn't tie their horse to car. Uh, that said, though, thank you for uh, joining me. Please hit that like, subscribe, Patreon is in the description. Let me know what you think about what we heard what we heard on today's episode. And I'll see you on the next one. I'm out of here. Peace.